Look at these little jerks, walking around like they own the place. Well, guess what? They don't. So let's get rid of them. Step one, put up an eviction notice. This lets the ants know that you are serious about wanting them to leave. Step two, sprinkle lemon juice around doorways and along walls. Ants don't like the smell and will run away like the tiny dorks they are. Important, the lemon must be in juice form. Do not use lemon starbursts. If you don't have lemons, oranges and ground cinnamon also work. Step three, mix borax, sugar, and water to create a tasty, poisonous death paste. Place it where you see the ants. They'll be stupid enough to take it back to the queen, and she'll be stupid enough to eat it. Without the queen, the male ants will get sad and cry a lot and stuff, and the colony will die of depression. Note, if you have pets or kids, or kid pets, be careful because borax is toxic and could be harmful if ingested. Step four, be a bad roommate. If you piss off your ant roommates enough, Maybe they'll get fed up and leave. Step five. Use diatomis, uh, diatomi, di, uh, use this stuff. Get the food grade kind and sprinkle it around the perimeter of infected rooms. It sticks to the ants and causes them to dehydrate over time. Bonus. Diplodocus earth is non-toxic, so it is safe for pets. Step six. Chalk. Ants don't like crossing lines of chalk. For best results, draw a pentagram to summon the demons of hell to aid in your conquest of these vile creatures. Step 7. Douse yourself in Axe Body Spray. If anything can clear a room, it's too much Axe Body Spray. <coughs> oh, Jesus. <coughs>